doing this. So what are we doing? We're wrapping the balls, the bird's foot, around a little napkin that's shaped as a ball, so it can have the shape of its foot, but at the same time help him because he's hurt. He got cut. Wait, so how are we gonna keep it like that though? Like have the gauze on there? Like we're gonna tie it or? We're gonna keep changing it. Yeah, I know, but how are you gonna make it like that? Like well, keep it like you know. In that way. Yeah. Um, be careful with his head. I know. So sorry. Um. Probably get something to hold it. Find teeny tiny pieces of tape or something that he won't really eat. He needs food. Or give us some food. Its foot got messed up because it landed in some kind of gunk. He was trying to fly it off of the gunk and it ripped his foot. His little his toes. toes. Good thing Esmeralda found him. Yeah, and we're gonna leave him somewhere, but Will Francis was like, no, get him. And then I was like, okay. Yeah, because you don't want the coyotes to okay with anyone, you. Anything, I, do, I wanted to keep him at first, but um, Francis said, oh, okay, well, keep him. And save his little life. Because mm. he's cuties and he's my furball. Be mm. careful, you don't want him to peck at you. Well, he, he's only tried pecking at her once, and that one was when he was first trying to wrap it. But now that he sees we're trying to help him, he hasn't really pecked at any How of us. How I... You need to go find Wait, something. I'm going to use this gunk for this. Why are you going <laughs> to use the gunk? Because it's sticky. Oh, it is? Yeah. yeah so it is probably gum or something. It's gum or something, but it hurt him. So we're doing first aid for a little Brady that we're going to keep as a pet now. What's his name? Fluffers. Fluffers. He looks like a little fluff ball. Kiwis and kiwis and he's kiwis. Okay. Oh, he pooed. He poo. He poo. He poo. He poo. Okay. So right. fluffers, just just sit back and then.